like, share, subscribe. I'm going to forget to tell you later. Hello, my scrappy friends. I can't... <laughs> I just realized I can't do this without... Uh, I can I can drive it. I can't run the bucket with... Uh, I, can't, I need both hands. It's good. Joysticks. Anyhow, let me get turned around here. I just gotta make sure I'm not hitting anything. Okay, then I got the little camera there so I don't hit the truck. I also don't want to hit the trailer at the front. I've already wrecked it enough. So, this is my. Uh, problem here there's still way too much frost in the ground over on that side the nice thing is uh, that I only had to go down a few inches and that was uh, hard uh, pit run gravel so uh, there was a little bit of crush on top that uh, the grass roots had gone into but no I've uh, just kind of spread this stuff out and uh, here well let's get up a little bit closer see what I've got from the road. I'm still going to have to rake it, but I mean, uh, it's it's not too bad. I'm just going to kind of track back it, and then later I will uh, rake this all in. But, yeah, so this is going to make it much nicer. Much nicer. And I've still got tons of material left. Anyhow, I got to go because I need both hands. Hello, my scrappy friends. So, in my... Uh, cleanup uh, effort I, I realized that uh, I needed to get all of that duct work inside which prompted me to do more cleanup inside let me show so not here so because it's uh, summer tire time the end of this month I got our summer tires ready and I got the summer tires for the van they were up in this corner so I brought all of the uh, duck stuff that was outside and stacked it up here in this corner because I really don't know if I'm ever going to use this I, I, or if anybody would ever want to buy it. But I have it. So, and then I've got the van tires here. I don't know if I'll put them on or not. But then I've got all this other duck work here that I'm also going to start stacking in there. It's almost canoe time. Hi, kitty. This is the kitty that sprayed in here last time. Hi, hey, Boodle. He's my good poppin' kitty. Watch. Kit. Yes. Oh, yes. You're a good cat. So, anyways, yeah, this is his, uh... Oh, I, I found this at the dump. This cat's garden was... Kit. I've been trying to get them to uh, use it. For whatever reason, they don't want to. But it's got these. It's a homemade jobby, but it's got these uh, pads on here. Get. Here, let me just see if I can. Come here, get. Oh, get. Look. Get. That's a scratch pad, too, bud. He's not as vocal as Earl, but he's still a nice cat. All right, kitty, gotta go do this other stuff. So, anyways, while while the welder was here, um, I need a bunch of plate for the top of the piles at the front. And you said that he just went in and picked up like enough to do that, and it was three hundred bucks. I was like, oh man, that's too much. But he said uh, there was a, another one of these server racks. I guess this is, I wonder if there's a way to, oh, here we go. So he said, hey, because I got one of these outside for that hydro thing. He said, hey, you, you've you got that channel right there. It's a good angle. He said, it doesn't matter. He said, use that stuff. I said, yeah, but there's only two. And then I remembered I had this one. The other one's welded on. This is bolted on. 
And it's going to give me a, an excuse to scrap this aluminum because I was like, oh, why would you scrap something that's still useful? And he said, oh, no. He said, it's a specialized piece. He said, you might as well scrap it. So, oh, sorry, kid. So anyways, that, between that and that other one, it's going to save me 300 bucks. Just going to have to put a little bit of work into it. The other one I got to grind off. They got it in a we they welded it on in a weird way, but it's like done from the inside. So I don't know if I'll be able to get my grinder in there, but hopefully. So I, and I, I brought my the big aluminum. There's still one outside, but uh, this is the stuff that's going to get scrapped. I might keep that smaller stuff there, and then uh, just for anything. This is, I've been building up my uh, pile of copper bearing, the, uh, oh wait, why is that in there? Oh, I guess I haven't scrapped, oh, there's a, man, I thought I scrapped all my magnetrons. That, uh, and my, uh, my bin here is getting filled up. That'll be a good winter's work, I think. Yeah. Man, I wish I had a notice that I could just hit the flash button on the on videos. So, yeah, and then I just keep working away here. And once I get done this job and, and the next job, I got like a 10-day job coming up in May. But uh, then I'll, I'll have some time to get back in here. Because there's, as you can see, there's a lot. There is a lot. Oh, yeah, and I got these out of the dump. I don't think they're any good. They just seem to be fans. But uh, they'll fit on those server racks, and, I, and there's a key for them that was with them. And then a bunch of this stuff. This stuff all got wet. I don't know what that is. There's only that board. It looks like the rest is empty. But, uh, yeah, I thought that would be cool if I get, like, uh, stereo components or something. I could put them in this thing, maybe. I don't know. But it'll fit right on those racks anyhow. Or it should. And, oh yeah, I got that too. I don't know. I don't know if that'll ever amount to anything. Oh, I got a tablet there too. Oh, that's a, that works. A tablet. Kitty, what, bud? Come on. All right, let's go in the house. All right, we're going to go in the house. Okay. I'm... I'm not going to say bye because I still have to show you outside. So this is all I'm doing now. I, uh, I got to wait till this thaws out here, which sucks. I guess I'll just have to hire somebody to come in. I was going to start throwing this stuff in here, but I'm going to have to dig it all out anyhow. So I figure I'd just leave that. Uh, exposed so this is this will be fine at least I've got a you know not a muddy driveway and once this all packs in it'll be just like asphalt so yeah then uh, it's gonna eventually come along here and then out there so the, the welder just left uh, that's gonna fix the trailer and I he gonna get him to cut that gate in half so we can put a hinge on either side. There's a hinge on the one side, but it's like 24 feet long and I can't uh, lift it. And uh, even putting a wheel on it is still not gonna do anything because I'd have to dig all that dirt out and I just don't feel like screwing around with that. So, yeah. But anyways, this is uh, at least a little bit done. And then, I don't know, it's supposed to rain again tomorrow. So what I might do is move the, the end of the pile here and then dig this all down. He also, the guy, he's been around here a long time. He said that uh, this whole thing was a parking lot. So it's got like a really good base. So I don't need to, um, I don't need to put the filter cloth down. He said he wouldn't even bother with it because that asphalt's going to uh, close out, kill any grass that's under there. So, then I just got to move this stuff, and then uh, tomorrow, Willie's coming, and we're going to take these trees down, and I'm going to pull all that fence out, like all this wood fence. The people, uh, 
that had this place before had all these posts here but yeah that's the plan anyways just all you can do is keep working away so I don't know if there's if you can see the rain but people in England probably are just like that's not rain <laughs> anyways I'm gonna gonna call her a day we'll talk to you all later